Hi guys, it's Owen Davis from GoldShake.com. I'm here at Gold and Gold Golf Club in Cambridgeshire. In my hands, I've got a brand new ping putter for 2016, 2017. So it's something very special actually, and something ping haven't haven't done or haven't tried for a very long time. They've been uh, revolutionary sometimes in the way they've made putters. Uh, they've been hugely successful. Lots of guys have had them in the bag. I'm sure you've probably had one in the bag at some point, but they've never really made putters right at the top end of the market. So I'm talking the 280, 300 pound mark. But this time, 2016, 2017, they've released something, four models, they're called the Volt line. And the Volt comes from the name of the, put the Volt they've got in California, where they gold plate their tour winners putters. Um, look it up online, it's absolutely amazing to see. Uh, they've got these hundreds and hundreds of putters for all their tour wins. So this is a Volt putter. It comes in four models, like I said, two blades, two mallets. Also comes in two finishes, so there's this uh, kind of light finish, there's also a slate finish which is much darker. So this light one is a platinum finish, and like I said, there's a slate one which is much darker finish. So there's two to choose from. There's loads of new technology in here as well, so you've got this um, kind of true roll face. And what a true roll face, what they mean by that is they've basically milled this, so they've got different depth mill, milled lines across the face. So wherever you hit it on the face, and there's, there's different intensity of them as well, wherever you hit it on the face, you'll get the same amount of backspin or roll or skid. You get the same thing every time. So it really doesn't matter. It evens that out, takes that guesswork out of it. Also on here, you'll see they've got one of these uh, kind of wind grips, um, same length all the way down, very fashionable at the moment, made hugely fashionable by Jordan Spieth and loads of guys on tour are using this. So I'm going to give this a go now um, and see what I think. So firstly, putting it down, it's quite a classical head design. Uh, it's a very satiny finish, you've got this kind of milling effect on the back as well, which is quite a nice, nice detail. Uh, nice alignment aid as well. I probably would prefer the slate finish myself, the platinum is a bit light, but um, it still looks really good and I think that's a personal choice. Put my hands on the grip, it's obviously got this really lightweight, big, modern grip, which takes the wrist out of it a bit. Okay, first thing to note, it's quite a light putter, um, which is kind of, which is great. If you're on slightly, you know, slower greens, a light putter is really, really going to help you. You're going to get a bit of extra speed through the ball. It also felt super soft off the face. I'm going to give it another go. Okay, really nice roll on that. So, it's, I mean, like I say, it's quite light. The face, the way that it feels off the face really does rival that kind of top-end market. You're going to get that soft feel that you're used to, but there's also quite a lot of technology in here. So, guys, you'll see this. There's, you know, there's loads of pro shops that stop ping. I no doubt they'll be in the shop soon. Go out, have a look, take them on the putting green. We'd love to know what you think of this and whether you're going to put it in the bag. We'd especially like to know your thoughts on the grip as well. I mean, uh, these are becoming more and more popular. If you haven't given one of these grips a go, give them a go. It'll take your wrist out of it a bit and you might find it a bit easier to hold some more putts. So, also, if you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to hit subscribe and we'll see you next time.